Hey, what's up, everybody? Um, the last video I uploaded, uh, the reason why I haven't really uploaded anything, uh, the last video that I uploaded uh, took like two or three days to upload. So I've kind of, and then like right after that, um, I just, my kids caught the flu and then they just gave it to me. And of course, some people that know me know that I've got bad teeth and I've been fighting with toothaches. Plus on top of, I think I've got this small case of the flu. I don't have it as bad as um, my kids had it, but I got it. So kind of more of an update. I, I kind of was extremely vague on my last video of why uh, things didn't work out in Colorado and what's going on here and things like that. So kind of an update, and I know I mentioned it kind of before. Um, I did look at a house. I got approved on one house and I needed like three days because the guy told me on Friday evening that I, hey look, animals on the wall. Ah! Just sorry. <laughs> he told me on Friday evening that I was approved for the house. It was like uh, eight ninety or eight ninety five or something like that, and I needed time. And he wanted and he wanted it in a cashier's check. And of course, my bank was closed, and it was closed on Saturday. I don't remember why. Um, oh, sorry. It was the whole New Year's thing. I got approved like during the whole New Year's thing, and the banks were closed. And so Monday came around. He told me early Monday morning, like I was like literally on my way to the bank to go get the cashier's checks, go over there. And I thought I was going to sign the lease. And he was like, well, since you didn't get here quick enough, I'm, I'm going to run it somebody else. So not, you know, not really in the mood. I haven't felt good in about a week. So week and a half, whatever. I was like, whatever. And just moved on. The good news is I found a house even bigger with, because this house had a small garage and a small backyard. And this house that I looked at the other day has a huge backyard. I'm, I don't know what an actual acre looks like, but this thing has got to be, if it's not an acre, it's close to an acre. It's got two garages in the back. It's, it's a huge house. Um, and they only want 10, you know, five, ten dollars more. They want nine hundred dollars for it. And I'm thinking, woohoo. So now I'm waiting to see if I get approved from that. And I don't think she's going to, you know, in three days tell me, oh, you're, out of luck so we're waiting on that and once that happens then i will give a video tour of that house a lot of work needs to be done to make it screen print and ready i've got to figure out there's a fuse box in the back in one of the garages but i got to figure out how like does it actually work can i run 220 out there um you know like you know like how's it wired and all that stuff sorry i'm laying in bed and holding my phone and all that so the whole thing with Colorado, what happened is just, it's not the screen printing, sign and banner industry, all of that is hurting really bad. A lot of it is because of the rent prices. The rent prices are so high that even business owners can afford extra stuff. And a lot of people consider t-shirts extra. Um, and then also when I would make an ad and I was cutting prices, uh, a screen printing shop in Denver would cut prices so much that I couldn't even compete with like $4 a shirt for 25 shirts. Um, you know, just the shirt alone, I've got $2 in it. Um, I probably could, but I'd make no money. I would have to have a lot of customers that wanted that deal. Um, so I'm waiting to hear back from a guy on an investor too. So let's see if he comes through um i couldn't breathe in colorado either like you know i was in colorado springs and anyone that's <clears throat> been to colorado springs lives in colorado springs you're approximately 6500 feet in the air i have asthma didn't help the situation in any way shape or form i didn't like the people there they were they, they were kind of rude and snotty um i had quite a few people try to rip me off like I printed for this one box company and he tried to, and he, and he, he tried to rip me off and that happened a lot. Plus I lived in a really bad neighborhood. I wouldn't call it a bad neighborhood. It was full of people from Mexico. I, I never had an issue with them. We all got along. I printed for some of them. Um, but when people would pull up because I do everything out of my house. So when people would pull up in the driveway and they'd notice who all lived there, they turn and they would leave. Very racist, very racist. 
Um, there's a couple of other issues. L like I said, I'm going to get all into that later videos, you know, let things get, you know, let things kind of, you know, I've got to get a place. I'll give what's going on in this house later videos. Uh, just kind of want to touch base. I don't know when this thing, I'm going to upload this thing as soon as I'm done. I'm going to make another video that has nothing to do with the series that I'm trying to do. Um, but guys, I'm hoping, um, I'm hoping that my videos are getting better. Um, minus this phone shaking like crazy. Once again, I'm sick. Turn it on. Turn it on. <laughs> um, every, every time I move, the phone light wobbles really bad. So I'm going to start getting into vlogging and things like that. I'm, I'm going to get a better computer in a couple of months. Um, well, next month, I'm going to get a brand new iMac, if not brand new, one to two years old. Um, I'm not going to get a MacBook, a MacBook Pro until they fix the keyboard issue. I don't know if the 2019 models, if the issue has been fixed or not. Um, but once I know it's fixed, once I see some of the reports coming out, then I'm also going to do a couple of gaming videos because, you know, I play uh, Apex and Destiny and all that. And I've got both of my little brothers are playing Apex or uh, not Apex Destiny. I'm going to try to get the other one to play Apex as well. And then we're going to be, you know, um, they're my brothers, but my two younger brothers, they're not brothers. They're um uh, my one brother that lives in Tennessee, he is from my dad. My other brother that lives in Oklahoma, he is on my mom's side. Um, so they don't talk, they don't communicate for, you know, no reason. They just honestly don't have a reason to. Um, not saying that they won't in the future. I don't even know if either one of them know that the other one exists. Um, so I'm going to get a lot more in depth of what I'm doing. The vlogs, I'm going to start doing vlogs. I'll have like a huge backyard um, so I can do stuff in my backyard. Like the backyard is literally big enough that I can get stuff for my kids. And I'm going to film the progress of my screen printing shop. Like there's bushes growing up on it and stuff. And that stuff needs to be cut down. And I need to be, you know, um, I got a power washer for screen printing. So I might as well use it for this, you know, for this thing. So... I'm going to film that, <coughs> excuse me, which I'm going to have to learn how to time lapse because I'm pretty sure you guys are not going to watch, want to watch 10 to 15 minutes of me, um, going to watch 10 to 15 minutes of me, you know, cutting bushes down and trimming trees and raking stuff and watering the grass and planting grass. Even. I'm just going to time lapse it. Um, so I'm also going to end up buying, I used to have a Nissan 300 ZX. It was in 1990, I believe. Um, so I'm going to buy another one. I found one. Um, the guy doesn't want a lot for it. Half the engine is tore down. Um, I'm going to start kind of doing that. And then as I kind of do stuff, as I vlog and business and auto and, you know, building cars and stuff like that, as they get bigger, I'll do, you know, and you guys like what you're seeing, whether it be auto or whatever, I'll start doing that a little more. There's a guy that does screen printing videos. I believe his name is Lee. He does screen printing and motorcycle videos on the same channel. So I'm going to have, you know, screen printing, vlogging, auto repair. And then if the auto repair um, takes off enough, I'll break it off and create and create its own channel. The screen printing personal life will kind of stay on the same channel. I don't want too many channels. Um, and once the subscriber count, because right now not very many people of my subscribers are watching my channels. It's non-subscribers. So I've got to find ways to get people, my subscribers to watch. So be expected more videos. I'm going to upload this now. I don't know how long. Um, I don't know how long. I think it's like 10 o'clock on the 7th. So we'll see when this video uploads. Um, right now, my internet's horrible. But once I get to the new place, I'll get Wi-Fi and internet. And I'm not getting cable or phone. So I will keep you guys more posted. I'm probably going to start making more videos. Once this uploads, I'm going to make another video, um, like I said, that has nothing to do with this series. This is, I think, video three, I think. Um, this may take days to upload, but we'll give her a try. All right, guys. So I will see you guys in the next one. And uh, stay positive. Damn sure if you live in Ohio and above, stay warm. 
I will see you guys in the next one.